Content warning. Ladies and gentlemen, the following podcast is not suitable for all audiences, and viewer slash listener discretion is advised. For example, if, when you just heard the term ladies and gentlemen, you immediately thought about how exclusionary it is, then it's probably best you turn this off now. <laughs> <laughs> you fucking animal! <laughs> oh, right. Oh God. Oh. oh, and he looked a bit like Carl from Have a <laughs> 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 Hello, welcome to Dead Man Talker with me, Rob Mulholland, and I'm a fat cunt. We've got... I'm not enabling this anymore. Yeah, you are. Mm. We've got a special episode today. We've got a special episode. Yeah, we've got a little guest in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. His name is Dan Nightingale. I don't know if you've heard of him, yeah. but he's a new up-and-coming comedian. Yeah, we thought we'd give him a hand up. You know, yeah. He's got a little podcast he's trying to get off the ground. I know. And the thing is about Dead Men Talking is that we want to help our friends out. Exactly. I'll Especially honest, ones who are so desperate. That podcast... It's not great either. I don't know if it's got a future. I don't think it's got. I don't mm. think it's going anywhere myself. But no. you can't say that to his face because he's trying. No, I mean, ironically, I would like to have a word with him. <laughs> it's been like knock it on the head, mate. Look, I mean, at the end of the day, it was nice to get him on, yeah. boost his profile. Yeah. You know, I don't think anyone really. No, no, it's not like he's exactly selling so. tours. No, not like he's selling thousands of tickets. Got a five thousand word show at a stadium. Ten thousand tickets at the Echo Arena. Sorry, the Eminence Park Arena. Yeah. Five thousand on his own tour in twenty twenty two. Yeah. So and that... I'm playing in Hull at the weekend <laughs> <laughs> to eighty people who don't know who I am. But yeah, it's a cracking episode. Uh, we'll get to it in a second. Uh, if you want more stuff from us, more extras, get on our Patreon. It's three pounds a month. You can join up. Uh, there's a link in the description. There's no below. tears. There's none of this three pound, five pound, yeah. ten pound, twenty pound, fifty pound bullshit. Three quid, you get absolutely everything. You get early access to episodes. You get access to our Discord community. You get to see all the fucked up videos. You get an extra Patreon episode a week. You get special Patreon-only content, such as Rob's uh, punishment set, where I did a five-minute set that he had to perform. Uh, you get discounts on merchandise. Loads of, like, a ridiculous amount of stuff for three quid. Yeah. And also you get to help support the podcast. We need it. Let's help be real. Help us grow. No one's sponsoring this Who's shit. Sponsor We're not going to be able to go on and say, this is brought to you by Manscaped. It's, they're not going to want Even anything to do with it. Even the bollock razors won't fucking have us. Right, <laughs> That's how fucking low we've fallen. Even craft beer that's been brewed in some fucking mother's bathtub yeah. looks at us and goes, no, that's too dirty. Too much. So, yeah, do get on the Patreon supporters. If you've got videos to send in, send them to 07520644931. And we've also got a live show on June the 15th at the Frog and Bucket. The loads of fun. Tickets are a fiver. Get down, get down. All right, I think that's enough uh, telling them shit. Shall we just get into this episode? It's a corker. Go watch the episode. Well, they're, on, they're doing that now. Go. It's going to... Stay where you are. Continue. It's going to it's gonna happen Continue now. Continue to watch the episode. Through the magic of ed editing, you will now see the episode. <laughs> Clap his little sausage fingers. You're oh. such a prick. The little chipolata slap. The, Three seconds. The clap. The clap's just Three taking second. me back. Well, clap to what? It's taking you back to what? Well, because we had to. We used to do the clap. Oh yeah. Oh, before yeah. they went fucking big oh, time. Oh yeah. Yeah. Us little amateur podcast with our little clap. Is it? When you got, I bet got you've got a little Peruvian boy, aren't you? <laughs> Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's called Finn. Yeah. Tiny little hands. Hello, please may I have number one Christmas single? Oh, I prefer to listen to that. <laughs> Mr. Dan. Um hi. Yeah, a number one was a, a bit of a reach. A bit of a reach. Do you know <laughs> number do, 101. Do you know why I was late? Uh why? because I left my dog in the house, uh, mm -hmm. just roaming, chilling, uh, while I went for breakfast with somebody. And when I came back, my dog had uh eaten his way into a a backpack and eaten a full sachet of Nescafe. Um, <laughs> and my, my dogs are Jack Russell yeah, and they're off tiny. their tips at the best of time. It's like it's like if Adam Rowe got himself into a bag of coke. That's right, what my yeah, dog's yeah. doing right now. He nice. sells two businesses. 
<laughs> Jack, Jack Russells are already like nature's yeah. fucking crystal method, aren't they? Yeah, 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 yeah. Just constantly. Oh, mate, when I saw him, he was literally doing laps of the coffee table, like, and he didn't even know I was there. He was just fucking hyped. Oh, my God, I love it. Like, you know how they say, like, dogs are like their owners? I love that Freddy's has just got into a backpack and eaten all the contents. <laughs> It oh, what? Oh, oh, fat cunt. Bit of a yeah, delay on that one. Oh, I like it. Nice well. one, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah you, got... you, can, you know, you know right, uh, some people with their uh, soundboard have got it in front of them, yeah. Yeah. but Rob's is just... I know, I've just got to do a little sneaky yeah. arm. <laughs> as soon as you hear the, see the arm, yeah. just reach back like... Yeah. He's, he's, got it in the, he's got it in the Stephen Hawking position. I know, just, like, know, just at the side. I just T-Rex it. <laughs> <laughs> so You're getting fucking murdered. Yeah. Pow. Oh, fuck well, this is up. nice to be here, isn't it? In the, um, I used to live in uh, where you live. Are you allowed to say where? Yeah, we like we, we mention it quite often. Cause right. we're, you know, we're, we're in Levenshoe. Number four. <laughs> Shut the fuck <laughs> up. <laughs> you know what? You know what the fans of this fucking podcast are like. They will turn up <laughs> with a four pack of monsters. I used to live. Right, I used to just live off the main road. I used to live off Stockport Road on the other side. Oh, nice, nice. It feels the other. Yeah, the other side of Levenshoe is the fancy side. We're in the Gorton end. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, I don't know if it was that fancy when I was there. I no, think it sure. might have been gentrified. It's gone up in the world. It's still We're hoping... super Asian, this side. Yes, it is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Super like, Asian. It's, it's also very Asian on the other side. It's just a very heavily Asian No, area. it's more... This is more Asian. Right, it's very Asian here, yeah. Because everyone's like, Levenshume's the old Irish part of right. uh, Manchester. You're like, wait, it might have been in the 1950s yeah, and yeah, 60s. Yeah. Now it's super Asian. But I, I've got quite, quite, got quite a nice car. But it, my car looks. Where's this going? Super <laughs> Asian. I had to stop my. Yeah, yeah. It's great. I've just parked up. I can't... Usually, if I park up and I'm like, oh, where am I parking? Yeah. My car looks so Asian. Yeah, yeah. It's safe as fuck. Box here. of tissues in the back. I bought it off an Asian guy and who told me. Yeah. <laughs> Who told me it was his, uh, his little, uncle's... little seat with beads on it. <laughs> <laughs> Any ne'er-do-wells around here are going to be like, it's probably my uncle's new motor. Yeah, yeah, I, yeah. S- I feel really chilled out. Like, whilst it. the houses are a bit rough, like, on the, like my street, there's loads of, like, mercs in that parked up, you know. Yeah. Yeah, yeah I know. Yeah yeah. yeah, yeah, we know. Yeah. Yeah. Not mine. <laughs> 2014, quite well looked after. Yeah yeah yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, I've literally just bought one of them. <laughs> yeah, I, was, I bought myself I saw you one. reverse, and yeah. I was like, Asian dude. And yeah. then I had to yeah, get yeah. closer, and I was like, oh, that's ah, he's just got a beard. Just Asian beard. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> just looks like Buddha. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So, have you, have you done I've seen you literally yesterday, yeah. is the problem. I've yeah. done nothing. Have you not? I've literally done fucking loads yesterday. What did you do? Got home, did a 5k. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Five bags of cat. (laughs) With his dog. (laughs) Yeah, yeah. Nah, we did um, extreme uh, marathon trails. Right. Yeah. Again, ate loads of Snickers. (laughs) What are you talking about? No, I just just lying. I I saw my mate uh, doing something and I thought I'd rip that off. So he's uh, doing a thing at the moment where he's doing extreme marathon in. Uh, that didn't sound right, did it? Yeah. No, Mar- there's a man who does not know in. about running. No, yeah. but mar- marathon in and in. Running in and um, <laughs> not, not the sound to make around here. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we've started right. strong. What is the furthest you've ever run? <laughs> You all right? It's a fair question, isn't it? What What is the furthest you think you've I, ever oh, run? I actually know the first I've ever run. <laughs> One hundred meters. No, the f- the first I've ever run is five minutes. Right, that's not uh, that's not a distance. No, I know, but that's the furthest I've ever right, run. Right, you, you consistently <coughs> ran for the whole five minutes yes. without stopping. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, that's... were you being chased or was the ice cream van leaving? No, no. <laughs> <laughs> um, it was on a treadmill. Right, and that was my someone had a donut on a stick. <laughs> That was my ta- that, that was that was my personal trainer. Great guy, great guy. Really was knows how to motivate you. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> had a whip in one hand and yeah. a fucking Krispy Kreme in the other. <laughs> Hiya, go, go, fat boy, go. Sounds kind of sexy. Run uh-huh. as fast as you can. Well, if you find that sexy, we've got some fun videos to show you later. Uh, yeah, I'm so no, I did. I, to I'm this. not. I'm not physically a runner. You don't say. Oh, my God. Well, that is... It's preach, Freddie. Preach. Yeah. Do you know why More it is? Assume, Do you know why it is? Uh, is because, because I've got flat arches. Shut oh, yeah. the fuck up. Have you flattened them with your fucking weight? <laughs> you got flat They used to be raised. That's why you're not an, an extreme right. marathon. Uh, <laughs> I've genuinely got flat foot arches. Yeah. Yeah. And I believe I needed, you do now. I, I, I feel like if I had somebody who... who 
took the time to get me the proper foot support. <laughs> Why don't you be that person? Go buy some fucking trainers then. If that's what's stopping you, go to a shop and buy some trainers. Yeah, but I, I don't know where to start. A shop. <laughs> yeah, I go know, to a shoe shop. I don't want it. Look, the if thing is... If you go is, to a running shop, they'll fit you for ones no, that are perfect. No, but the thing is, if you go into Sports Direct or something like that... No, you're no, not, no, a bit higher. No, no, you're not yeah. getting the level of customer... Yeah, you so go don't in, go to Sports Direct. Yeah. You go in there... Because they've and, been human trafficked and they work for £2.10 <laughs> an hour. Yeah. Come on, Stacey. Yeah. You're not even fit enough to work in a brothel. No. <laughs> Sp- sports direct you go. Hello. You're looking for football shit. I was looking for better life and I did not find that either. We have Nike trainers. Uh, not good ones, uh, but Nike trainers. Have you got Puma? We got yeah. all the Puma. Yeah. Have you got you like what? Lonsdale. Yeah. Do, you like, hey. do you like Puma that's also affiliated with Ferrari? Yeah. <laughs> hey, my nephew, he stitched this himself. In factory, yeah. back in Bucharest. Like I fucking yeah, you can't were. even say Bucharest. Bucharest. <laughs> yeah, it's just in seven European cities. <laughs> was that Bucharest or Budapest? It, it was, was both. It, it was, was both. both. It was once. amalgamation. You yeah. can't be racist if you're wrong. Exactly. I mean, I think you can. Yeah, I yeah. think you can. Yeah. yeah. But I fucking love all the excuses that fat cunts have for not being a fat. Cunt. Like why they're a fat cunt. It's like oh, me arches, flat arches. Fuck me. <laughs> I do, well, I do is have... that the uh, that's the only barrier? Is it between if you had didn't have flat arches, right. you'd be I feel you'd be Paul the fucking if I, had, if I had if I had <laughs> Mo Farah's arches, right? I feel like within a year yeah. I'd be at a different level to what I am now. Right. Well, why yeah, don't you yeah. start with Mo Farah's <laughs> diet? Right. Yeah. Eat a fucking bit corn, of corn. Have a bit of corn, lad. I oh that advert that advert used to piss me right yeah. off. You know he comes on TV and he goes, I I, I got where I was because of corn. Yeah, it's corn like, and genetics and your well, arches. No. no, no, no. Let's be <laughs> real. Your it's, beautiful arch prick. <laughs> the corn is a very much a euphemism for performance enhancing drugs with Mo Farah. No, no, he's not. Shut no, the is he? Do you not really know this, oh, Uncle Mo? Right, his, his personal best dropped seven seconds yeah. in, when he was 26 in one season. I know. Why? Because he was tired of taking drugs. Because he also, had a coach that cared. Th- yeah, he cared to call that doctor in Spain who had all them samples <laughs> in his fridge. And like, you know, there was a whole documentary about it. He's a shady cunt. He's like a really horrible piece of shit, Mo Farah. He's one of them who pretends to be nice, but he's a proper... Do- there was a whole panorama on it. Uh, no. Yeah, you saw the panorama. Come on, mate. Get on panorama. I did the see, king of the arches. I did see last night that yeah. thing that you told me to watch. The man with the dick on his arm. Have you seen the man with the dick on his arm? Have I seen the man with the dick on his arm? Isn't it the best thing in the world? I haven't seen the man with the dick on his arm. But I want to hear all about the man with the dick on his arm. Well, it's about a man, right? Okay, break it down. Okay, right. His arm is a bit weird. Where is it? Right. The Uh, forearm, they're flopping away. It's like on the back of his forearm, just hanging about. Floppity, flop, flop. So what happened, right, was this guy, right, he he was a drug addict. This is true, so I'm not even bullshitting this. He was a drug addict, and he got a big cyst on his gooch, right? Right. Because he was, I think he was injecting in it. And it got all infected. What is an injecting in the goo? Because if you run out of places to inject, they inject in weird places. Sh- honestly, still a vein. it's got to be the last place you think, though, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think he's run out of areas. No, I don't think so. Oh, what? Y- yes, I so, do. So, in so, the so, precious so... undercarriage that no one should ever see or touch. <laughs> well, <laughs> this g- is it. So you don't want your arms, your beautiful arms that are on show what all are the you time, on about? to be full of fucking little. Do you scab think the marks? guy with the dick on his arm gives a fuck about a scab mark? No, but I can. I, I bet he did when he was starting out. Yeah, but he, by the time you're injecting your gooch, oh. you're not starting out. That's not mm. a beginner move, right? He's burnt through all the veins in his arms. He, at this oh, point. Okay, all right. That's bottom. why you inject your gooch. Is there any veins in your bottom? I bet it takes no. longer Long because of the because yeah. the fat. I bet it takes longer yeah. to get through your bum. Does it take fucking three days? <laughs> Can't set me up like I'm, that. I'm going to the post office Friday. Give yourself a lovely boost. <laughs> oh. Yeah. But that, like, so he uh, he was injecting himself in his gut anyway. <coughs> I think that was what was happening. He got all infected, right? And he tried to pop the cyst himself because he didn't want to go doctors. You know, NHS is stretched. So he uh, he popped he popped the cyst with a syringe. I don't know what with. To be fair, I don't oh, think he mentioned this it. This started so sexy this episode. Right, so, and it burst, but then it got all infected. Because they, they do, of course that. it did. Because he yeah. did it in a garage, and he's a smackhead. Yeah, right, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. They're not known for and that. And he's sterilised. <laughs> <laughs> so he gets all infected, right? Then his dick went black. Right, and he was having a piss one day, and it just fell off in the toilet. His black dick just fell yeah. off in the so, toilet. So, so what happened is he went for an operation. He's a white guy. Yeah, he got a black dick. Yeah, it went massive. It dropped. Um, just the weight. 
<laughs> so, so yeah, there is, is no Dro- Jesus. Dropped yeah. off, and they grew another one on his arm, right? Because they and make they, it out of like arm skin and that, so they attach it to your arm for a bit to make it like and grow. They, yeah. and then they transfer and it they onto like, your knob bit. Listen, Derek, or whatever his fucking name was, yeah. that's going to grow on your arm for two weeks, and it's going to become a mighty a bit more than that. It's going to become a mighty cock, right? And once we're done, it was a big old one as well because you get to choose the size. Once if we're done, your once we're done between you know three or four weeks later or whatever. We're going to come back. I think a couple, a few months. We're going to come back. We're going to take it off your arm, stick it where it should be, yeah. line everything up, line the wheels together. Jobs kick are good. Kick the and tires. Kick the tires. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> like track, and, track and balance your piss off. Yeah. Right. Bang, <laughs> bang all the dings out. And then, and then off the you dings go. Out. Off you go. MOT ready. See us in 12 months. Yeah. Right. But this guy's so much of a smackhead, he just didn't go to any appointments for 12 years. <laughs> it's, it's, it's six years, but like, he just kept, miss, he kept missing him. Did he he inje- had the dick on his arm for six years. He no, didn't for 12. In- he had the dick on his arm for 12. He didn't inject into his dick arm, did he? Oh, arm that, dick. To be fair, that's a, you're just giving him more skin to I inject found an, in, aren't I you? I found a new vein. He's got loads of veins. But honestly, honestly, his, his, his dick looked like it had lived on an arm for... 12 years yeah. it, it looked bad great it, great imagery it, oh yeah, yeah yeah it looked like a it looked like a dog toy it looked like it had been chewed like it wasn't like a good dick but it was it was a big old weapon fair to play but you know oh it was wide once it had yeah. finished wasn't it but you've got to it put was an like, asterisk on it it, it, it was like deodorant can wide <laughs> yeah. it was too wide I'd it's have like a wind assisted dick. long jump I'd have had my dick because I, I, I'd have had it a bit thinner than that because it was it was like yeah. that genuinely it was massive yeah. Had it grown wrong? No, 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 no. I he, think he, he was just, just chosen that. Yeah, because the thing is, is, if you don't have a dick, and then someone says, grow your own dick, you don't go, just medium. You go, It'd be the very biggest hard. cock. It'd be very hard to be restrained in that situation, wouldn't oh, it? If you could design your, your own dick. dick. Yeah. Because oh, you've got to, you've got to wheel it back a bit. You don't want it so big it's an issue. Yeah. But also, you want to go for as big as you can get away with, oh, don't you? Oh, God, yes. Mm. Right. 100%. Yeah, absolutely. And that's surely the Weapon. one. Weapon. That's, that's your payoff, isn't it? Like, your dick's fallen off, you've been traumatised, but now you've got a massive one. You've got a massive, healthy, mm. v- tanned I... cock mm-hmm. on a smackhead that's yeah, got scabs but, on his goof. Yeah, but I bet... You're, you're picturing this dick a lot nicer than I'm it is. I'm picturing this dick on me. I bet the sensations... Phenomenal. <laughs> the sensations probably aren't... It's probably like... Yeah. You know when your leg's got pins and needles? Yeah. And you just... Gotta yeah. slap it to try and come on, come on. <laughs> Freddy's analogy. Hey, do you know what? Do you know what? I started you know talking? when your legs got pins and needles all the time. Do you know, you know what? You, makes you, you know come. when your arm hurts and you have to be like, come on. Not do you know what? Do you know what started to happen to me recently yeah. that I'm a little bit concerned about in terms of my own health? Uh, I go for a shit and get pins and needles. <laughs> oh, Freddy. Oh, Jesus. Oh, like, die on pod, mate. Yeah. Die on pod. Yeah, that's that's, do the... It is bad, that, isn't it? Yeah. Oh. If, you, if you feel like you're going to go, set up a GoPro. <laughs> so, like, but how... So right. Elvis went. If how... we can't monetize your death, what <laughs> is the point? That's a patron exclusive. Yeah, 100%. We're not oh, putting that out on public. God. Like, how long are you on the toilet before before you get pins and needles? So, I mean, I, I obviously, I shit regularly. Um, yeah. But sometimes it's I think just, regular is probably not the right word. It's about is it? where I'm sat, and sometimes I try and I, I, I try and arch my legs up more. But obviously, with your flat feet, with very my flat hard. arches. <laughs> see, this is this is it. This is why it affects me in different ways. Mo Farah just shitting brilliantly. <laughs> I bet he does. To yeah, be fair, oh, I bet he's got a God. lovely poo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> And, right. I don't so have the best. How, so, yeah, so I, I bet your shits are horrific. I bet. Do you but know what? I'd imagine they'd come out quick from you. I bet that I imagine they'd be like an oil slick. <laughs> like, you know, it'd just be like, flack! <laughs> like, and it's just gone. A load of seagulls yeah. <laughs> floundering. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I tend like, to do. I tend to just do. got a little toothbrush cleaning them off. <laughs> A volunteer team in Freddy's bathroom. Some vegan lesbian yeah. like, oh my god. No, that's proper. I, I don't even know why they're in here. That's how I pictured you shitting though. I imagined it would be very quick, but the cleanup would take ages. <laughs> I, you know, so, like you poo instantly and then you got to spend half an hour wiping. Well, look, it tends to be a more than one flush job. It's like the fourth bridge. By the time you finish, you got to start again. <laughs> um, but I tend to have, sometimes I'll do three little poos and they'll be of different consistency. This consist- little poo went to market. <laughs> That little poo stayed at home. Uh, so, so um, that little poo's got a flat arch. <laughs> That's no way to talk about Mo Farah. <laughs> so, so, I, I tend to do three poos, right? Or two or three. 
but the weirdest thing is that <laughs> the, so three they're a, all three, you're on a three a day system no no three at once right right how long between poos but, is that not just one poo that's but, broken into bits yeah probably but here's the thing so you do is, poo stop poo is, stop yeah, yeah how long are the pauses I've not thought about that. How mm. long are you in there from the point you walk yeah. in the bathroom to the point you walk out? So so sometimes I get bored and I just go on my phone and then I need to shit again. Do a Zoom gig. <laughs> Sorry, you sit on your phone for so long you need another shit. <laughs> yeah. That's insane. How long are we talking? How long does it take you to need another shit? So no, I'm imagining no, no. you going every 20 no, minutes. No, 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 but sometimes I just, I'm, I, I quite enjoy shitting. So, oh yeah, hot, yeah. No, no all, could, all, all piss take aside, yeah. absolutely. Yeah, when yeah. it's an unsatisfying one, it, it's just the feeling is more than unsatisfying. Have like you ever a, had that thing? Poo is... Have you had that, that thing before with a poo where you are desperate for a shit? You absolutely need one, but you can't have one. By the time you go to need one, it's it's disappeared. Yeah, your body's gone into self defense mode. Yeah. Like yeah, yeah, and so your body you don't goes shit in a in a car. I've just stored it somewhere. And you go, no, yeah. it's all right. And your body goes, ah, don't worry about it. It's the same it. with piss. If, you, if you've been, like, busting on a drive and then you get finally get to a toilet, you, you expect it to be the mother of all pisses. And it's like your body's like, no, do you I know, don't trust that you need to do this. It's hard. Do it's you know like, what I oh, found out recently? That most people can't have a shit without also pissing. Yeah, I saw you tweet about this. And, like, I know the reason that you're, like, surprised by that it isn't that everyone else is weird. It's because you've got a slack arsehole and shit just falls out no, of you. No, no, I haven't. Without got, any I've, pressure. No, I've got... No, it's because you're doing three poos no, over the course no, of two hours. Yeah, you've dehydrated yourself. Taking the yourself. paper, you know. Yeah. It's because I, I have quite a tall... Already a bit time in I have got quite a taut, taut anus. I don't believe you. I have. I have. I've got a really... Tortainous. Tortainous. Show Sounds the like camera. A, oh, dinosaur. Show the camera. I will. Well, not now. Show the camera. No, not Don't show the camera. Guests. Don't show so, the camera. I'm near the camera. <laughs> so, I can feel like I can push backwards for a poo and forwards for a wee. I don't just push. I can localise my it, pushes. You can put your ass into reverse. Yes. Are you, can I ask a question as a guest? Are you allowed to masturbate on pod? Oh, it's actively encouraged. Oh, okay, because yeah. I am pretty close. Yeah. That's Freddie's ass. Yeah. <laughs> no, I don't. I, didn't, I just. That's what he sounds like. I'll show you where that's from later. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there's loads of just weird sounds, and then you go, "What's that from?" And then you see it, and you go, "Oh god!" Oh, that's... I can't wait to get to it. Oh, yeah. oh my god! Oh my god! It's so... so good to be on a podcast where someone prepares. It's yeah. really. It's good. Yeah. 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 yeah, more than well. Yeah, yeah that's true. I don't. Yeah. I don't prepare slap, at all. That's bullshit. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I just. I literally just turn up here. Yeah. Fifteen minutes late. As four shits, and then we get to recording. I've so, never done a shit in your house. Rob, thank God. Rob, when he drops, gives a call. I. <laughs> I do, think. Mate. I think you'd be really upset if I pooed at your house. Yeah, I would. Yeah. So I've not done yeah. it yet. I will do Thank it at some you. point. It's it's an inevitability. No, we're, we're moving to a studio before you do a shit here. No, I'm, I'm, like, so, I'm going to do a shit here before no, I think you do a shit here. Yeah, don't. You've, st you've still not answered the questions, though. How long do you reckon your average shitting session is? Between 10 and 15. Between 10 and 15? Well, you're making it sound like there's more going on than 10 to 15. In, yes. in 10 minutes, <coughs> you yeah. can have a shit, yep. wait a bit, yep. get pins and needles, and then do another shit. Yeah. Fucking what that's, that's not normal that's that not is right normal no it's not it's normal for you mm -hmm. do you take reading not... matter into the toilet i'm, I'm very uh, much like i'm in i'm out i try right i try not to take my phone because otherwise i will get distracted on what? it you're just, you're just reading tweets so, with no, 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 but if no, i'm no, having no, no. a shit i will take it because because if yeah. you if you don't take your phone into the toilet it's yeah. the worst experience because all you're doing is sat there feeling shit come out your yeah, ass I'm really experiencing it it's horrible Wow. You just sat there focusing on shit coming out your bum. Yeah. yeah, I'm out. Yeah, but you sat there just feeling shit fall out your bum. Yeah, it's nice. What? You, that's I'm why only you in the there for a couple of minutes. Distract yeah. you. You distract on your phone. No, and then you're just rubbing poo particles over your fucking phone. Mm. <laughs> what about rubbing? Oh, it's some poo, poo time. Yeah. What? So I like, just I will go in. Ha! Out. <laughs> so I'm not messing about. Is that yeah. the sound you make? I never. It's a. <laughs> Like a fucking Everybody was kung fu shiting. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Amazing. Those shits were fast as lightning. Also, what I don't do is go, <laughs> I like to have a poo at this time of day. 
I wait till my body's like, Dan, you have no time to waste. Right. Like, I can't. I, you very, like going to the wire. Oh, I take it to the wire. Mm. It's very rare that I don't jog to the loo when I need a shit. <laughs> like, Laura will just, and, oh, I'll just, oh, and go, I'll just say, go time. You it's are, go time. Are your boxes not what? an absolute mess? No, I don't. I mean, if you're just waiting, glass houses, if, you're just, if you're just waiting until that poo is fucking. It's not out. At the you door. Know, yeah, it's knocking. at the door, it's not through it. Hey, do you know how people knock at doors? They don't knock on doors while, like, fucking stinking the fingers through the <laughs> letterbox. You can knock not on a door without wait. any of you being in the fucking <laughs> house. <laughs> a fuck kind of knocking on doors. Like, I'm knocking on the door, I've got my dick in the yeah. letterbox. You're knocking Classic on the Freddy. outside of the door. <laughs> okay. You, and you think enough. you've got a tort sphincter? <laughs> if I need a shit, I've already it's started already shitting. Out. I mean, 10% is absolutely normal. Yeah. Oh, my first God. of three. So you shit in trilogies. <laughs> <laughs> I like to do point two before I've even started uh, shitting. It's like the George Lucas of shitting. <laughs> oh, I just... <laughs> Phenomenal, the Rob. The Lord of the Rob. Brown Rings. Rob. Phenomenal. <laughs> Thanks, mate. Very, very nice. But like, so, I've just... And, so, then, I'm and so... then he does Lord of the Rings. <laughs> I said Lord of the Brown Rings. The famous George Lucas. <laughs> I don't know any George Lucas. What, what did George Lucas <laughs> Star Wars? Star Wars, Wars you <laughs> it, it made sense, but it didn't make sense. It was great. <sighs> I'm going to crack into this water and just let you two get on with it. Right. So, you... Freddy, don't. It's much better when you're telling us about your poo poos. <laughs> so, you t- so, you're averaging a shit every five minutes when you're on the toilet. Probably are, yeah, yeah. 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 But like, that's with, like, see, so how long of that five minutes are you shitting for and how long are you pausing? Maybe like a minute and a half. So you shit for a minute and a half. This is like a fucking like it it's like what... CrossFit for fat cunts, isn't it? Like it's... shit for a minute and a half, rest for three and a half. Yeah. High intensity shit in You're training. Inter- yeah, yeah, yeah. Interval shits. Yeah. Like... yeah. My toilet sessions are wads. <laughs> so I... They're named after dead soldiers. <laughs> that was just... a murph. That one was a murph, that's why I'm tired. I'm just off for a captain, Tom. <laughs> Just that is, yeah. You, you. Yeah. This is your Good body telling on the you the toilet, things. love. I raised three million for the NHS. <laughs> oh, so, like, you, you realise this is your body telling you stuff? No, it's not. It's just the way my body. I've just got a different body. Yeah, fat body. I, I think I've lost weight. How? I think you've all lost of weight. these. Thank shits. you, mate. I disagree. No, he was fucking massive before. <laughs> yeah, and he's still fucking in. No, I, I've got no fucking room. But you like, got you, a little, you, look, you got a little. Yeah, but you got a middle-aged belly, haven't you? This is like a your yeah. a dad belly. Yeah, this is, you know. dad belly. He's got a mum to be belly. <laughs> <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Come on, Rob's on fire today. He's, yeah, he's doing all right. We keep setting him up too yeah. easily. Just yeah. pop it up, I'll fucking hit it. Exactly, because what <laughs> is, I give him the first 20 minutes, yeah. and then the last 20, I just do as many your dad doesn't love you jokes as I can. Oh, you just come back, you come round. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. Ironically, I'm... like you finish like Mo Farah. Yes. <laughs> now, what he does is he does one, waits about five minutes, gets pins and needles, does another dad-dad joke. Well, yeah. he's not dead. It might be, who knows. Really? I don't know. If Probably was, not. I probably would have found if out. If he was, would you be upset? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> like, no idea. Are we, uh, are we son's, son's papi? Yeah. Oh. Son, son's papi? Son's papi. Are you... Pretty sure Bielsa tried to sign him. <laughs> <laughs> play for Newell's old boys. It sounds like If he can play in midfield, we'll fucking have him. It sounds rangy. Yeah. Um... I didn't know that. Oh, that's exciting. Yeah, so his, his dad. Yeah. Um, look at you with your fucking normal, Look at him, look at him trying family. to get away from his, him being a his, disgusting his, fat con. He's dad, just got to slam this in. His dad uh, is in the SAS. No, was a Roma, he was a Royal Marine commando. Yeah. Yeah, yeah we've done yeah. loads of jokes about him hiding from his son for 15 years and stuff, yeah, yeah, you know. Yeah. Right. Yeah, the yeah. apple fell f- quite far from the tree. <laughs> And then, and then, I couldn't and then be grew, less of a commander. And then grew legs, and then kept walking away from the tree yeah, yeah, while yeah, shouting yeah. back, "Well, be in touch." <laughs> <laughs> don't, don't worry, tree. I'll come back, and we'll spend some quality uh, apple tree time together. Well, like, but like, yeah, my whole family on that side are all military, going way back. They're all like all soldiers, all like officers and shit. Some of them, and like some of them were just privates getting blown up. And then there's me, <laughs> like it's probably best that you're estranged, isn't it? Yeah. Really, like, I don't, I don't, you know, I don't uh, respond well to authority or early mornings. So you know, the army's not really well for no. me. I wouldn't fit in a trench. 
But you don't have many qualifications. So that's true. Like, I, look, I have the societal background to end up in the army. Yeah, yeah. In the, you know, I flunked. I flunked most of my exams. You know. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Went to Goldsmiths. Classic SAS. Yeah, cl- class, classic <laughs> army move. We didn't have a lot of recruiters at Goldsmiths turning up. You didn't finish your modern art degree. Yeah. We need someone to paint the tanks. <laughs> he who dares. I don't know what Goldsmiths is. Oh, it's an art college in London that I went to. It's where what? I didn't study art, but like it's a massive. It's like a very famous art university. I went. To, uh, it's where Can Damien. You draw things? No, no, I didn't do art. I, I did politics at Goldsmiths. You did politics at an art college. Yeah, but it's also like a university. It's a very good university, actually. Goldsmiths is good. Yeah. yeah. Damien Hurst went there. Tracy Emin went there. I, I nearly really? applied for Goldsmiths. Lucian Freud went it's there. Cool. It's a cool uni. Yeah. So how did you get in there? You're by thick clearing, as fuck. mate. Did yeah. you? No, because I'm dead smart. I just flunked my exams. Yeah, you know, like, so he's like a uh, you know predicted three see, A's and A see, A relatively listen, working class lad from Yorkshire. That was like an alternative. Hang like, about a minute. Minority. The, no, it was before they gave a fuck about that. Listen, oh, right. listen. The I'm dead smart, but I flunked my exams is the mental equivalent of the I'm dead fat, but I've got <laughs> low arches. Yeah, it's yeah, the yeah, same yeah, fucking I'm ment- thing. I'm yeah, mentally yeah. quick over the first five years. <laughs> well, <laughs> I, am, I am clever. I just didn't want to do it. <laughs> No, all right, this is very ableist, this conversation. Oh, you're not going to oh, throw yeah. this in. Yeah. Oh. I honestly, I need so much convincing that this is a real thing. Well, that, he- right, right, here's my question. If I don't have ADHD, why am I such a spastic? Because some people just are. Like, some people just yeah. are. There's some people in the world who are quite smart but just cannot access the discipline yeah. needed And we call those people to... ADHD. No, 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 we just call them people. They're just people. Yeah. Not everybody can reach access their potential. Access the discipline to do three yeah. shits in 10 Talking about fucking discipline from this cunt who won't go for a fucking jog and have a salad. Like, unreal. Because I don't like doing those things. I don't like exams. Yeah, but it's, mm. yeah, okay, yeah. fair enough. I've never yeah. been more annoyed with your ADHD than when you started a massive war in stand-up. Oh god, yeah. Through not wanting to have to apply yeah. for shitty gigs on yeah. your own, that got your agent at the time all yeah. revved up. What and was started that? The most uh, annoying yeah. thing that I've ever but had to be involved in. What I was, was super annoyed as well. What happened? I got snaked by the person in the forum, and it never was like I left it fucking private. But there was a there was a there was a behind the scenes snaking that led to all of that, and it became a thing where it was on me. And so I was fucking ju- livid. Just for everyone who's yeah. listening, it doesn't really give a shit. It was about four three years ago, something like that. Four yeah. years ago, pre, way pre pandemic. It was when I was helping out with the uh, yeah. the pro comedy page where comedians put gigs up and comedians yeah. apply. So and I, it would I, been it had been set up that no agents could be involved. Yeah. And it was an old standing thing of like, look, it's an absolute, all the agents like looking after their own gigs has yeah, been going yeah. on for years. And that was one thing, one place in the whole industry where comics could be like, look, there's a gig. Do you want to do this gig? And promoters could be like, not for agents, but for comedians, just yeah. looking after ourselves. And it all booted off about four years ago yeah, because yeah. Uh, Rob was like, listen, well, this is how it seemed. It was yeah, like, yeah. I, can't, I can't concentrate to, yeah, I, yeah. messages are tiring. Can you let my agent in? And it fucking booted. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. mental but that's, that's the, you, the thing is everyone else came in halfway through the story right so what happened was there is a certain there was a certain person who ran that forum for ages who was you know uh like basically i contacted them privately and being like hey i'm paying for this fucking agent because i'm shit at this and i keep losing work yeah can I send stuff from the forum to them and go, can you just And they the said messages? unequivocally, no. No, they said unequivocally, yes. Oh, really? A hundred percent. They said, absolutely fine, not a bother, right? That, that's grand, totally understand. So I was like, cool. So I did that. Then someone like grasped back to them and they put a public post on that forum going, no fucking age, all this, cussing me out. Snaky cunt. Snaking me out. And that's, I was like, I ain't having fucking this. Oh, well, this and is, then, that's good. Then I was literally, again, messaging privately, like, look, all I want to do is send my agent shit. I don't want agents in this. And they made it a thing of, right, are we letting agents in the group or not? It got really and divisive came, and yeah, I was yeah. involved in the page. And you know, after all of that, and it re- about six yeah, it months later, crazy. you left that agent. Yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> Wait, I remember thinking, fuck you, Mulholland, yeah. and your ADHD. Yeah. 
Oh well, my I, fuck, God. I, I fucking stand by <coughs> all this of is, that. This is very like, much uh, the uh, the Bosman ruling of comedy, yeah, isn't it? Mm. In that a, a shit to average professional changed the fucking industry forever. Yeah, yeah. Um, got, my, got my name in the history book. Yes. However, you're really good at the fucking detail for this. Yeah. yeah so but, is it just when you're? It's almost like it's fake. No, anyway, it's sorry. because I was doing so much extra <laughs> shit. I was really annoyed by someone who does fucking nothing but coast on being like around from the nineties. Doesn't write a fucking new joke. Doesn't do anything. Oh, there's loads I'm, of them. I'm, cunts. Like, was the person who was snaking me on that when I was like doing all this shit, doing all the internet stuff. So what I did was I fired my agent and hired an editor. I couldn't do everything I was doing. Can I? Um, so like, yeah, I needed yeah, to yeah, cut yeah, it cool, down. Cool, cool. On that note, so, you know, can I just say that uh, if you are one of those comedians um, yeah. that uh, has been doing the same set for the last ten years. I don't respect you. Yeah, no, I, I don't. Try, I just need you and to this, know. That was a part of what annoyed you. me. I was getting like, uh, there was uh, someone getting nice in my fucking, in like, getting in like, getting involved in my fucking career who has no idea what my career is because they're not doing the same shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And they were just trying to protect themselves because they like had the thing of like, oh, it's agents taking my work. It's like, no, you're not getting booked because you're fucking shit. Yeah. Oh, it's just know. funny that it, it, it became it way part out. of ADHD. It like, went it, way out of my control. Like, uh, yeah, but that... Yeah. Um, you know that that goes full circle though, because I worked with Mick Miller the other night, who is fucking love of Miller. the sixties and seventies. Yeah, like yeah. he's a proper like, from yeah. the seventies comedian. Yeah, yeah. Like he's he's a mate of all the legends that died. Like he, all of his old boys mates are great. Yeah. And I watched him last night at a charity gig for the Ukraine, and his set is older than me. And I thought it was fucking Miller great. gets a pass. What did Miller he, yeah. definitely what gets sort of a pass? Did he? Like what was it? He's just got jokes, mate. mate he's, he's just he's got jokes. Best. Was it like my, Take, my, my mother? No, 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 no. no. Oh, do you not know Mick Miller? He's a legend. No, like, I know. my favorite Mick Miller. The gags. He's like they're... my favorite of his is like I hate people who take drugs. Can't stand people who take fucking drugs. You know, like security guards and TSA agents. <laughs> Fucking great! It's got some. It's hard because if you do one of his jokes, so take your jokes, take well, your sorry. drugs. Yeah, I know that's that's it's a great I, gag. I honestly think that that's dreadful. It's a great I gag. That's... You got to watch him deliver them as well. I think man. that's a, if if you open that gag up in a Christmas cracker, you go, oh. Oh, I yeah, but if you watch Mick Miller do it, it's fucking brilliant. Yeah. Mick Miller yeah. is a legend, mate. Old school. Like, he's, he's I don't brilliant. like British comedy in general, to be honest with you. So I'm yeah, not really well, you know, person to last, last night I did this charity gig, and he was on for twelve minutes, and he had, I think, 14, 15, 16 punchlines. Yeah, he's, and then he's, I watched, so that's I watched, impressive. I watched the next guy go up, who was one of ours, yeah, and yeah, yeah. he had four maybe really yeah. i'm honest like it made me go what was his it name? was great watching mick, mick miller last night what was his name oh, as if we're doing that <laughs> fucking someone we know <laughs> right and, let's get the line up off. <laughs> and it was it was I, I, I went in and got my notebook out and i was like fucking right quickly yeah. just get the funnies out oh, i'd like to great. watch him i'd like to watch it. he's just it's not he's brilliant it's not it's also a class laugh. it's not the sort of comedy that i would watch no um, but like no don't get me wrong. I'm not watching his fucking special. See, I, see, I did. He hasn't got one. No, yeah. no, he's got one set and he's had it see, for fifty years. He's got on uh, YouTube. <coughs> there's an hour long set that's you know that's filmed and like I watched it over lockdown because I was missing stand up and it, like I was crying laughing. But you, you best. almost have to. You you know like with some films you've got to suspend disbelief. Mm. You've got to sort of put away your modern. This is what I think is great. You just got to enjoy yeah. it for what it is. And it's it's not Chappelle. Yeah, but it is. Really, it was a lot of fucking funnier than Dave Chappelle's last special. Yeah, he wasn't I mean, fucking moaning about trans people. The I was going to say I can't, I can't enjoy it if it's not transphobic. So. <laughs> Unless he's got a couple of I think zingers. If, I think if you're listening, these <laughs> these old boys have got trans anti trans stuff from way back yeah, from like yeah, yeah. OG anti-trans yeah. stuff not like the modern transphobia where it's like you've dead named them where it's like <laughs> now they're like fucking disgusting it's a cock in a frock yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's a different fucking which level is, which is what they'd say sure. in the olden days the olden Freddie days. doing your little like <laughs> oh in my head I just thought that's a great title for the next Edinburgh show that I bring up <laughs> No, it's not. No, it's, oh, no, it's it, not. No, it's but not. it would be for me. It would be for me. Yeah. But it wouldn't be for you. No. Yeah. No, so you don't need to poke that hornet's nest anymore. No, no, no. I mean, I only named my uh, 
last comedy special after a prominent person in black history, and that oh, didn't God, fucking... That, that was fucking ridiculous. Yeah. Well, I'm going to do it after for all of them now, I've decided. No, don't. So the next one's Mandela. No, don't. And then there's uh, MLK. Oh, don't. So, like... <laughs> it was the most pretentious shit I've ever... <laughs> and, then, and then, and so, then after that, there's going to be Jordan and then so LeBron. For anyone, so for anyone who doesn't know, Freddie named his, his last special after... Uh, what's her first name? Something Bonnelly. She, uh, she, Surya. Surya Bonnelly. She, he, she was a, a black woman who did backflips on the ice and was penalised for doing two dangerous things because, like, basically a competitor No, do that's it. not... So that's, she was a that's pion- not what happened She was all. a pioneering you've, black you've, woman. You've, and Freddie went, that's basically the same as me doing rape jokes. <laughs> <laughs> at hot water. Yeah. And I yeah. stand by it. Yeah. With everyone at hot water being oh, so I'm against sorry. it. I'm sorry. <laughs> am, I only, am I only allowed to be inspired by people that have the same skin colour as me, Rob? Because that's racist. I mean, like, uh, no, you should probably uh, shouldn't but, 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 claim their triumphs as part of your uh, shitty little thing. Oh, you know what? my like, God. Going, like, it's just, you're comparing yourself Mate, to... Mate, I watched 12 Years a Slave and I felt something. <laughs> <laughs> Does that make me a bad man? How long have you been doing stand-up? Uh, 12 years. <laughs> yes. <laughs> That's your new edit material. <laughs> 12 years a slave to the laughter. To the rhythm. <laughs> slave to the circuit. That's perfect. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 12 years a slave, bracket to the circuits, close brackets. Jesus. Okay. Uh, <laughs> Quingo Unchained. <laughs> <laughs> brackets roots, close brackets in comedy. Roots in Preston. Never has shop talk been so dangerous. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone was like, "God, they're really getting into this." Uh, I got, I got a lot of flack for talk. it, but quite frankly, I, th- I think that you can be inspired by different things and different people. Oh, you, you, that yeah. point stands. It was a weird name for a special. Yeah, yeah it, it was. was, just, it was I'm just not a... very good at naming things. No, yeah. I get what you mean. But Christ was... Almighty, I named a podcast "Pigoted" for fuck's sake. <laughs> You've nailed yeah. it with this one. Though. Nailed it with this. Yeah, because Rob did it. Yeah. You've nailed it. Yeah, thanks, mate. Yeah, exactly. I'm, good, I'm good at titles. ADHD as fuck, mate. If you're enjoying Dead Man Talking, and why wouldn't you? Maybe you've just got some taste and decency. But if you don't, if you're scum like us, come join us on our Patreon. It's £3 a month. What do you get for that three quid, Freddy? Nothing. <laughs> yeah, fuck you. Nothing. You get one of these. You we can fucking swivel on it, cunt. We take it and we yeah. go, what a daft wanker. Yeah. And, and we wh- throw it into a pit. And what we do is we Google you and we find out whichever charity you're like least happy about and we donate it to them. So if you're like one of the people who booze the knee at the football, we give it to BLM, right? But if you're like, if you're someone, if you're like a big lefty, right, yeah. we'll donate it to, uh, to uh, what is it, like GBB News. Yeah. If you're a big fan of the World Wildlife Foundation, we snap a swan's neck. Yeah. Donate us three pounds a month so we can burn down some trees. <laughs> but also as well, you also do get... <gasps> Special discount merchandise codes. When we've got merch for sale. You have um, an extra episode once a week that we put out just for Patreons. Extra Patreon content. So sometimes we film extra stuff such as Rob's Punishment set. Or our which live roast a show. five minute set that I wrote that uh, Rob had to perform. Live roast show stuff. Uh, roasting the streets and stuff like that. Uh, you get early access to episodes. You get uh, access to our Discord server and the videos that we put out yeah, there. so you can get yourself some deep long lasting Trauma. There's already over a thousand people that are uh, f- a part of the Patreon. There's already up to a thousand people. I think there are thereabouts that are on the Discord. Yeah. You're part of a growing community that of more and more people. Bastards. Yeah, uh, look, if you're that kind of person that's got a messed up sense of humour, that's way more than your mates, and you're like, how can I let that horrible bit out of me? Get on the Discord, get yeah. on the Patreon, because you will meet people who are exactly like you, and you'll be like, oh my god, where have I been all my life? We also yeah. do live events, we're going to crash a horrible pub and get pissed in it. Oh, yeah. It's mental, and we want you to be a part of it. If you enjoy Dead Men Talking, chuck us three quid, because it means we can grow and make this bigger and better. And we, I'm going to be honest with you, we're going to use your money to troll people and upset people. Yeah. Yeah, basically. So, give us three quid, you cunt. Yeah. I want to puke. Do you right now? No, I just want you to make. Oh, um, you want to oh, see right. some? You want to see some ting? Partly, Let's I'm here because I want to see if right. you can. Right. right. So, well, so can we'll I give just you say, the bucket? Has Jamie want? puked into this? No, no one's actually puked yet. There's a little bit of cigar rash. Yeah, yeah, we smoked some cigars we had some when we cigars. hit a thousand. So in here, yeah, yeah, yeah it was great. We were celebrating yeah. our Patreon and it kicking stunk off like this for a month. It, yeah, yeah, it yeah. fucking so stunk. proud of that like fucking Patreon kicking off. Yeah, it was fucking you know, I was, Thanks, I was in Mallorca. Can I have one of those? While that well? was happening, I want to get myself something in my stomach Thanks. to make. I want there to be yeah. something there to. I want it to. No. We should have got milkshakes. How, in how good can you ASMR this? This eating. 
Oh, that is quite good. Mm. That is quite... Let me... I, give me a go. You need to... Right, ready? Ready? Don't. <laughs> That's not me doing it. That's, That's ready eating. <laughs> That's... Stop. Right here. That's not me doing it. Stop. <laughs> He won't let me it's have anything. Me. He won't let me. me have anything. Freddie, you talking sounds like ASMR. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Straight through you, that one. Oh. These Oreo cookies. <laughs> what do you think is the type of things we're going to show you? What yeah. do you think is going to be the well, ballpark? I'm a fan of your mum's house. I'm, I'm, mm -hmm. I'm hoping for nothing less. Right, well, I'm, I'm sure we can... What's the worst thing you've ever seen? <laughs> worst video you've ever seen? Um, recently, mm -hmm. I saw a guy, I don't know, I, I'm not... I'm quite down the middle for this. I'm not yeah. one of these people that, I can't watch it, the humanity. Sure, sure, At the sure. same time, you know, like, Al-Qaeda beheadings, when people are like, did, yeah. you, did you see it? I'm like, no, because that will do, haunt me. We don't do death. That will haunt me. I can't do that. It's one of I've our... watched Al-Qaeda beheadings before. I bet you Yeah, have. I know you have. I, yeah. I got a lot of time to kill on the I toilet. I can't. Like Barry God... <laughs> <laughs> Bloody hell, I've got a shit that's like this. <laughs> Trying to get it off for ages, and then all of a sudden it flops. Chop, chop the head off that one. Oh, oh God. So, um, we'll, <laughs> so we'll, we'll, start off, uh, we'll start off with a gentle one. We'll work our way in. Right, we'll work our way in. We'll just do it. We'll start off with a nice, just little gentle, fun one. Right. Uh, da -da -da -da. Oh, this is really gentle. <laughs> this exactly. One. Just like, just give you an idea of what's coming up. Right. We've just got a little. little oh, dog puking here. dogs. <laughs> <laughs> there it is. Good. Oh, it's just a, a dildo. Just, just a dog throwing up a vibrator. Oh, it's a rabbit. dildo. It's a big pink dildo. Oh, oh. There look we go. That's nice. How they, how they, oh, the vets put a thing down for. Yeah, you've got to put paper down for that. Anyway, do you are you aware of the concept of um, Chekhov's gun? Go on. So, like, it's an idea in uh, in in like theatre that if you put a Anton gun... Anton Chekhov. Yeah, exactly. If you put a gun... I went to see the seagull, like a pretentious little A level student, <laughs> pretended I knew what had happened. Yeah. Boring as fuck. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, it, his concept was if you put a gun on stage in the first act, someone must fire it in the third. Yeah. So basically, if you put a prop into a scene, it's got to be used. Yeah, yeah, you know, you yeah, yeah, yeah. Can't yeah, put yeah. something there unnecessarily. Can I quickly take this moment while you're loading that to say I never yeah. want to hear you explain Chekhov's gun ever again because I've heard it about twelve times. I know. <laughs> It's, it's the one thing that Rob explains that makes him sound really oh, it, smart about yeah, it as well. No, but I just think, it's a, really, I think it's a really good way to set up this video. I think it, you know, it gives you an idea of what's coming. So it's like the new. No. <laughs> oh no! Oh, she's gonna prolapse! Oh my god! She's gonna prolapse! She looks so tired! I know, what oh you? Look at the face! Look at the look of regret! Oh my god! Oh no! She's got so many, hasn't she? <laughs> she's like, oh. oh, the smell of that room. Look, it's just like speculum it open. No. Look, you can watch it wink. No. Look at it wink. Yeah. She's gonna die. <coughs> she's gonna die. Whoa, what's she called? Let's give her a juice. At, well, in, I don't know if Alex Rod is her website. That's where it's been sent to us from. If anyone does know her name, please let us know. I tell you what, I, I bet she doesn't take 15 minutes to have a shit, does she? <laughs> she does that oh, all in one. That, I bet go she, that I, goal was as open as her <laughs> arsehole. Mate. I bet she doesn't need 15 minutes. I bet she never gets pins and needles. <laughs> Look at them arches as well. Perfect. Yeah, to be fair, Absolutely they are very perfect. Arched. She's got everything in her favour. Bet arched. she could run for days. <laughs> <laughs> With a nappy. Um, do you know... Do you know um, oh, should, have we got a good naked Martin video? Hang on, hang on. Right, Hang on. Hold on, I think we're rushing to, through these videos too quick. Oh, mate, what, we've what? got so many. Got let's, so many. Let's, let's find some new ones. Oh, like, I've got a couple of new ones to show you a bit. I want to oh. show them some classics. Okay, some Oh, classics. these are the classics. Yeah, this is one of the classics, I'd say. Wow. Yeah. Um, is this How a, are you feeling is this after a, that one? I don't like the, pr I, uh, the, the... 
You're not a fan of a prolapse. I am dirty. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. But I cannot disconnect mm. from the future health of the women involved in these yeah, things. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm like, you are... She's 26, 27 years old. Mm -hmm. And she I'm has got... I'm of an 80-year-old. She, she, she's going to be in... <laughs> In some Buka Pest <laughs> doctors. Buka Pest. Buka yeah. from before. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And they're going to be like, what did you do? Her ass is going to be like, you know when and like... she's going to be like... Oh, you know when emo's... Like, Rob Mulholland show it. Like, I did this. And you're going to be like, right, cool. We're not... What can we do? It's your no, fault. It's like when emos have those big plugs in their ears. You know, oh. and they get all stretched out and floppy afterwards. And then the sad ones, when yeah. it goes... Yeah. She's fucked. Yeah. Oh... I like so, it. So you, oh, I wonder if she's got a boyfriend and he's just like, oh, how was work today? And she's just like, <laughs> yeah. oh, did, you make, you did you make dinner, darling? Yeah. And it she's just sat there farting yeah. through it. I made a curry, but do you know what? It's <laughs> best we don't have it. <laughs> it's probably best not. And he, yeah. he just likes missionary vaginal sex. Yeah. <laughs> he just wants to, can I just have sex with your well, vagina? You, she's like, you fucking pussy. You don't want a bummer. Get the bollard. Get the bollard. <laughs> no, bumming is going to feel Awful. nothing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I do not have the equipment to adequately bum this woman. Like, yeah. you know, there's nothing gonna, I can do It's, it's, it's going to feel like when you go potholing. She might be able to grab it when she winks. <laughs> Gross, isn't it? Right, <laughs> another one. So you're not, in, you're not into prolapses. That's the thing that you're not. You've good got with. loads. You've got bear, you've got bare prolapses, haven't you? Oh, we got. Yeah. <laughs> what? Why is it so clean? Why is it so clean? It's so clean. It's so She's popping it back in. Yeah. Oh, no. It looks like a clanger's nose, doesn't it? Is that, is that her whole bowel? <laughs> it's a big bit of it. It's a whole bowel. It's a big bit of a it's bowel. Like, oh, no, don't push anymore, love. Don't push anymore. <laughs> no, There'll it's... be a kidney comes out. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> it's when she inflates it. Isn't oh, it? my God. <laughs> oh no, the control! And now I did this. No, 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 not again. Not, not from that position. <laughs> Fuck me. My neighbours used to have a little dog, and when you went round, oh. I remember one barbecue. Oh. We were watching. I think it was SummerSlam 1993, <laughs> and it came in, and I was, I was like, you know, stroking its tummy, yeah. and its little dick, its little fucking oh, pink lipstick came Boing. out. And that is the honestly the strongest memory I haven't thought about SummerSlam '93 since then. <laughs> it looks like a a dog's. Di it, oh. oh, stop squeezing! My uh, my dog uh, humps What's this, this big bit. My my dog humps this teddy that we got from Bilderbear for it. He humps the life out of it. One time he humped it so much his dick was his dog dick was out. But he was humping it so much, shit started flying out of his ass. <laughs> Yeah. Huh? Did you get a video of any shots? <laughs> <laughs> and here it is, sent him. It's right. Look, you've got no, to what... admire the athletic prowess of this woman. You know, she clearly has some good core control, doesn't she? Oh my god. How does it feel Why like ticking on it like earth that? Oh! Would she go for a, a marine motif in terms of the decor? Yeah, it is a weird background, isn't it? Oh it's like a toilet in a theme pub. Yeah. No no more of this one. because uh, she's gotta be dead already. Look at her. Yeah. Oh, God. To be fair, she looks Ukrainian, so there's a possibility. <laughs> that, that, and also, as well, with the fishing motif, there's a chance it was fucking filmed in Mariupol, so... Looks like, look, <laughs> looks like a walnut whip, doesn't it? <laughs> Strong one, that, isn't it? So, she's got a nice vagina, though. Lovely, but could you deal with that? What a real... Honestly, lovely vagina. Might, might tickle your balls, well, that. Well, it could... <laughs> I'd ask for that to be put away for the duration. I would like her to keep it in, yeah. Doesn't it look like Cyril Sneer's nose? Yeah. <laughs> yes, it does. And there's a part of my childhood gone through. <laughs> oh, my God. Yeah, mad that one, isn't it? Yeah, I was thinking raccoons. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> well, should we... Uh, I reckon we might introduce one with a bit of jeopardy. A oh, okay. Of, a bit of jeopardy into this one. Deep in that one. Uh, question about the uh, mouse trap, dick trap. Uh -huh. Yeah. Uh, his dick look really help. 
what's going on here? You, we've just seen mm. one of the worst prolapse only fans in the world. Yeah, yeah. perfectly nice vagina. Yeah, you've skipped straight onto a guy who clearly gets off on. It, that dick was hard. He was like, oh, yeah, he's oh, I, ready to it, go. So I think engorged is not I a think, word I enjoy using, but it's sure. probably. But his dick looked healthy, mm -hmm. moisturized, and unbruised. Well, was it the first time? <laughs> he said, "It was that." Did he film the first time? He thought, "Do you know what? I'm going to stick it in a mouth." Dan, no, to be fair, if you if you are going to do it, do film it in case you never yeah. want to do it again. In it, you know, content I, is king, isn't it? <laughs> Dan, I think what maybe, you're. Maybe. He's been watching Gary V. I think. I think <laughs> I'm going for mid tier yeah, after this. He's, uh, <laughs> he's filmed it like Casey Naysart. He's got a fucking 4K gimbal going on. He's really telling a story behind his fucking dick slamming. Couldn't answer his own emails. Started a war in the whole of comedy, but he can he can like religiously put out a cue of like, okay, prolapse, prolapse. Uh, dick, people, dick pe mouse chat. People send me these. Um, I do nothing. Rob, they just Rob, get WhatsApp to me. Right, right, Rob. Yeah. Yeah. I think what Dan is trying to say yeah. is that he would like a dick in worse condition. Now, perhaps, Rob, we one could might show him one. No, no, no. A bit more no, equipment. I would say mm -hmm. one, the hits. I would say one like a breakfast that show. perhaps a young woman is giving a blowjob to to try and make the dick look a bit better, in a better mm. condition. Maybe to lick bits oh, off. Which file's that in? Oh, oh okay, it? trying to clean it up a little oh, bit. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Oh, oh, yeah. okay. Oh, yeah. Rob knows which one you mean. He's in invoices. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. I, just, I just had to yeah. find it. So open the folder marked uh, mashed up dicks. Yeah. Is it weird knowing what hard drive's going to send you to prison? Right, here we go. Right, right. Fun soundtrack on this one. It's like June. Oh. Just say what you see, Dan. It's, it's, it's knob cheese. It's, it's a lot of knob it's cheese. It's cream knob cheese. This video is entitled Smeg and Soldiers. Smeg and Soldiers. Smeg and Marco. Oh, God. Smeg and Marco. <laughs> yeah. Oh, in the, don't do it, love. In the, the royal family fucking don't, hate it. Oh, no, don't do it. You feel ill. Get a cracker. <laughs> <laughs> oh, get a cracker. Go on. Give it a lick. Don't go straight in the mouth. Lick it. There you go. Always test what you... Yeah. Oh my god. Yeah. Oh my god. This is like my toddler trying to fit back. Oh, I don't like I hope it. Oh, this is not like your toddler. Yeah, it's not. It's a little different. Oh god. Is that naturally occurring dick cheese? It looks like oh. it. Or is it just. <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe that question. Of, of all the fucking videos that we've shown, you're the first person to see a, a an oriental woman licking dick cheese I off a knob. I didn't and, even see her at this too. And the question that you ask is... You just is, saw a woman eating ch dick cheese. Whether or not it's organic. <laughs> Yeah, it's GMO. In this yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Oh, these listen. fucking vegans. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. Say what you want. It's naturally sourced knob cheese. Yeah. Right. Um, so yeah, she she continues. Uh, he's having a great time. Oh, he's, he's, he's not got much of a dick. But... <laughs> oh, I'm gonna get comfy for this. Watch when she gets that big lump. Shut up, Freddy, you pussy. Oh. Are you puking? Nearly, yeah. Oh, you fucking pussy. Take that. <laughs> you absolute more. Do it. Do it to me. This is nothing. Look at her. You made your choices, love. You'll send the invoice. Ah, ugh. Oh. Yeah. That, there was just a minute then oh, when I just caught it. I caught him. it for what it was. Oh. Do you know what? I feel like she's we're... praying he comes just to wash the taste away. <laughs> oh, oh, Philadelphia. <laughs> <laughs> the last thing you need is more jizz as into this. That's a mix. new name, <laughs> mate. Um, Have you got any new ones? I, I've got a couple. I, I, I will, before we do, I will I work just, up. I, can I, I just tell you? Yeah, it's so refreshing to come on a podcast. Yeah. Where the line is further than our line at Have a Word. <laughs> yeah. Because I've done a couple of other podcasts and you, I went and did another one pod yeah. and just tried to make a joke and they were like, What are you doing? And you're like, We're trying to make a joke. It's a comedy podcast. Oh, yeah. They'll tell and, you off of that on there. And then I did, <laughs> yeah. And then I did the Mild High Club live show and just tried to make them laugh, Have a Word style. And just a few of them were like, Oh, what? Yeah. It's yeah. so nice to be on here. We are, we are I'm the I'm, bottom of the barrel. I, I'm literally I'm pushing it as far as I can go, and you're like, <laughs> yeah. And it's really, it's such a nice do you, feeling. Do you worry about getting in trouble off Have a Word? Because you had a moment where it was a bit, ooh, 
we've upset a couple of people. Now, we purposely try and push things as far as we possibly can. Yeah, we just decided and to leave it. Because we've not put anything out on social media, people are... No one's called us up on it yet. And yet we're, we're horrible every single episode. I just think you close, you know, you you you're opening doors for yourself in in one in one breath, and you are closing others. Yeah, exactly. Yes. You, just, you just got to be like, I spent twenty years trying to do comedy, like everyone told me to do comedy. Yeah, yeah. I'm not I'm not really talking about my stand up because my stand up is actually quite accessible yeah. and less yeah, less, yeah, yeah. less abrasive yeah. um, than yours or yours or <laughs> even Adams. Like, yeah. I think, I, but think, but in terms of online content and your sense way. of humour, yeah. 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 I've spent so long going, oh, well, maybe I'll do Edinburgh and maybe they just want more stories and, oh, David O'Doherty does well and Jason Cook did well doing his show and mm. maybe I'll do that. And isn't it amazing to just find e equally mentally ill people to listen to your bullshit? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, so I don't worry because... We have no bosses. You have no bosses. This is and it. that's the key. You can't get cancelled off your own podcast. You can't get it's, sacked if you don't have a boss. It's, it's really exactly. funny that, like, obviously, we know it's going to be an inevitability at some point that we're going to get in trouble. And we've even we've even talked about what our apology uh, video is going to be. Oh, you, by the way, the dream for this oh, is yeah. to get like, so. Oh, if oh, someone do you writes so a blog, much good. So, oh, our thing, amazing. our thing is that we're going to be the camera's going to be really close on our heads, right? Black turtleneck, black turtleneck, and we're, we're going to be reading an apology. You know, like I really apologise for the statements that I made seventy two hours ago. I'm it different was a person. different time. Yeah, I've grown it was a different. You know, time. but all this time the camera's going to be panning out Got and hacked. panning out and panning out yeah. and it's going to pan out to the point where you see with our other hand we're just wanking off <laughs> that was Freddie's idea yeah. cool yeah. can we not get your dog to fuck the builder bear and shit at the same time in <laughs> shot <laughs> He's, he's just with I, the prolapse video player. I can't wait. I can't wait for the time when people are like, "Listen, guys, if you two do not apologise, then we are going to make sure that you are never on television." And yeah. we go about uh, that. Yeah. Oh this no, is, this is my how, flourishing yeah. TV career is down the drain. This is how dark you're going. <laughs> if they want to scold you, the yeah. worst thing they can do is scold you. That, what a beautiful place to be. Yeah. Because if they do, if they try and cancel you, it's just free publicity. Exactly. And they, yeah. and they're not sure, but they must know that. Yeah, oh, I love you it. You think they give a fuck? Lads, this is so good. It's what great. More, hit me. Yeah, Come on. Yeah, yeah. Get that I, fucking I'm bucket. Gonna, I'd love it if you puked and not me. I've got, I've got a bunch of new ones just downloading. I'll play a couple of classics before we get to them. Oh, lovely, yeah, yeah, lovely. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, I, I like a couple the classics, more... but I like seeing new... I like breaking new ground. Totally. There's just a couple of classics more I want to show to Dan because he's enjoying himself so in his penis. Was it moisturiser just in the in the penis? No, that's I'd rather lick smeg than moisturiser. That's soapy taste. Te Look, okay, cut that off. No, <laughs> no context. No context. Do you like the? Uh, I want to. I want to show you this one. Um, do you? Are, are you like a handy guy, Dan? Do you do any like absolute, DIY? Absolutely not. I could, I'm right. not bad around the garden, but that's have you just ever used a drill? Work. People, people who have brain injuries. I know where this is going. People who have brain injuries can do landscape gardening. Right. So I, that's my level. Yeah, as yeah. soon as it's in the house and something can be broken. Right. Laura doesn't Don't let use me any do power tools. I'm not a power tool right. guy. Would you like a little instructional video on how to use a power tool? I imagine that I don't. Right, but well, I let's, do. have a, let's have a little watch. Just have a little drill. Little drill. <laughs> uh, Dan, can you describe what you're seeing? Yeah, what did you just watch then? Um, I'm watching a looks like a, a bar back, a bartender in, yeah, a, does. in some got... kind of gay sex club, I imagine. It's you. With a probably hundred to hundred and fifty pound home DIY drill. Mm. Yeah, it's a, good quality with, to be fair. It's yeah, decent. Is tool. it Bosch? Um with <laughs> a yeah, with a <laughs> what I hope is not like a threaded screw. Yeah, we, you can't really see what what the drill bit is, but whatever it, it is, it's it, not it's great. A, it's a, it looks like it's for concrete and, and brick. And not yes. for urethras. Not no. for urethras. Yeah, it's just, again... Mm. Yeah, and like contrary to the, the mousetrap dick, that one is beaten up. Like right. the, the drill dick is like yeah. really... Like, if you're... The music... 
look, it's all cut around the balls. It's got a cut down there in the oh, shaft. Oh, he's dying. He's dead. Yeah. He's dead. He's his dick dead. is slowly dying. He's, he's going to have one on dead. his arm in a couple of weeks. Oh, it's a dead man. Yeah. And he's, I love it. The guy's taking his shoes off. Like, I've just got new Converse. I'm not getting your dick blood on my shoes. Just <laughs> appalling people. That honestly, what if that's honestly, if that's again, if that's Ukraine, oi, yeah. Vlad, do them a favour. I uh, got not, uh, right. Let me just. Uh, let me, I'll show you. That one made more me classic. grab my winky. That one. I show, don't know. You won't, might have not seen. I, it I does just, do that, doesn't it? Yeah, like yeah. when you see a dick being tortured, yeah, it makes you, you feel your own dick go. Ooh. Well, yeah, I do. It's like, it's, yeah, 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 it knows. Right. It knows. I've just found that out about myself because this I haven't watched that before. Right. It's like yeah. When you, that's classic. I've said this for years. I'm fairly quick. Yeah, yeah. When you see a dick being tortured. You know, and I've that's not what I sound. Is that what I sound like? Yeah, I do sound like this. I'm pretty queen. I've got flat arches and a uh, fat tit. Uh, classic. <laughs> do, you, do, you like, do you remember Kim and Aggie? I'll show you one more classic, and then we'll get to some new. I ones. knew you were going to say this at some point. Do you remember Kim and Aggie? Do you remember this Kim is... and Aggie? Uh, the, well, the they, cleaning people. Yeah, yeah, they, yeah, yeah. yeah. One, know, one looked like it, she was super tanned and blonde yeah, and yeah, fat yeah. and shiny. Exactly. Yeah. Like an so, awful scouse whale. So their whole. <laughs> <laughs> that whole thing was like, uh, you know, coming up with new ways to clean things. Imagine right. if she was scared. Lads, your house is fucking minging. <laughs> it's disgusting. You're a fucking rat. And I can <laughs> see a fucking rat. So, it literally sounds like how I make my living. Like, in my yeah, ears, yeah, I was like, is, oh my God, it's, it's at home. When we're recording. So uh, <laughs> we've, we've got a guy here who's come up with a new method of cleaning things. Mm. Oh, there we go. Is there, is there poo in there? There is poo in there. There's quite a bit. Ah. Yeah. Here we go. Have a look. Keep have looking. Look. Ah. Mr. Nightingale, we appear to have found your weakness. <laughs> I think we know. I think I know what video to show him to get him. Oh, my mouth water. I think I know what uh, video to show him. Upside down in the mouth? Upside down in the... Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, hey, Dan, why, Dan why you might is... need to take this for this one. Right, we'll, we'll do, here we go. Okay, this is going to be the one. <sighs> This is going to be the one. Ready? Oh, uh, no. Hang on. Hang on. Dan, hang on, hang on. watch. Oh. Dan, you're not many... Uh, uh, you know, are you worried about your heads? No. No. No! 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 Oh, save him, balls. Hairy balls, save him. No, 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 no. Oh, my God. Don't do it. It's there. It's right there. It's right there. <laughs> You fucking animal! You fucking animal! Right. Oh, God! Oh, oh and he looked a bit like Carl from Have a Word. Uh, <laughs> you fucking animals! Uh, <laughs> <right>. <laughs> mm. It's the one he gets it like a cigar. Isn't it? He's got it like a little cigar out of his mouth. Like that's the bit that gets me. Oh, I was so confident one I before. Yeah, yeah. so <laughs> confident. Yeah. Do you know what? This oh, everyone's got a weakness. We're going mm. poopy now. Now. Now, if your weakness is poo, then unfortunately, and we've got I'm a, in trouble. We've in got lot lots of, of poo. You're in, you're in a lot Bring of on Naked Martin. <laughs> Should we do a Naked Martin one? Oh, yeah. All right. oh, I long for the days of the prolapse. Uh, da, 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 da. Where's a good Naked Martin one? Here Guys, next time, I need a new, I need a new one try, of these. Try, I, mean, I wonder, try the cum sandwich one. Uh, all right, I'll show, him that, I'll show him that in a minute. I'll show, I'm just going to show... This is one of our... This is a friend of the podcast, Naked Martin. Right. A genuine friend yeah. who we chat to, who is a lovely fella. Yeah. He's just got a weird way of uh, living. Yeah. Martin, you stay there. No, he's not. Oh, he's not stay. done. You stay there, he? Martin. He's not gonna, is he? He's not done. He's, he's not rough, done. Rough, 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 rough. <laughs> Pause it. Yeah. Pause it. Pause yeah. it. Yeah. It is so frightening to me yeah. that a middle-aged guy who's yeah. pretending to be a dog. Yeah. And making videos, <laughs> making videos of him pooing and smearing it around, yeah. still knows how to set up a backdrop better than most of the comedians <laughs> in 
in <laughs> fucking comedy. <laughs> Why does Naked Martin... It's got better production values the, than 90% the, of the comics. The poo nonce, Naked Martin, yeah. know how to set up a fucking camera and a backdrop. Look at the lighting. Yeah. The no, lighting he, is he better what, than another one pod. Yeah, he knows what he's doing. <laughs> <laughs> he knows what he's doing. Yeah. yeah. He's not done, though. He's not quite finished. Oh. Yeah. So, can you describe what you've seen, Dan? I've seen a guy who does not want the doorbell to go with an Amazon. <laughs> <laughs> Mate, if he gets an Amazon delivery now. Uh, yeah. No, he's got to be signed for. Uh, Just leave it at the door. We've got to take a picture yeah. of you at the door. Uh, oh, look at his eyes. What, what one of the, this is what's upsetting about these last three videos? Yeah, these yeah. people are smearing, eating, yeah. and b drinking shit. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, and they look all three of them. Yeah, the 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 whites of the first dude's eyes clear, crystal clear. Yeah, they all look better than most of the stand-up comedians that I know. <laughs> it is are they, true. Are they are they actually living better? Yeah. Because the most of the stand ups on the circuit. They'd have to do three hours up and down the M6 yeah. every week. I'll tell you what about eating your own shit. There's no travel. Do you know do you know how much it costs to get him to do a video like this? Have a guess. Because he, he does them by order. You yeah. can order them oh, off. Oh, yeah. well that makes it less so it makes weird. Him living. They're bespoke. Yeah, bespoke. Yeah. How much? Yeah. It's seventy five quid. Yeah. Yeah. About about there. Well it's between thirty and a hundred, depending on what oh, you want. Super. I'm glad mm. I got that nearly spot yeah, on. That's yeah. pretty good. That's yeah, good. Made me worried. Right, well we'll go to a couple of new ones. Um there's a couple of these. I can't really remember what's in them because I've just downloaded them quickly. Let it, let but so we have our rules, don't we? No We have our rules. No animals, no kids, no death, no racism. Those are our rules. Apart from that, go wild. Yeah, but, if, know, it's very but if you have one with all four, we will show it. Yeah, yeah. If you get, if you get, if you get a royal, if you get flush, a, yeah, a, a racist <laughs> kid being bummed to death by an Alsatian. What is it? What we'll is it? You want to do? No death, no racism, no kids, no animals. Uh, the quadruple. And thing. even with the animals, we, what, one, we would like to show animal porn, but it's very illegal. Yeah. And we'd also like to show kid and porn. To but... be honest, we, we have we have a... <laughs> we, we apparently have... parents get involved. With the animals, all of a sudden they want a few patrons to keep quiet. <laughs> with, with the animals bit, we do sort of have an exception for insects because they're not they don't really count. I no. don't think. You know. Okay, is yeah. that with what you say no, now? Lads. Oh my lord! Looks like a special in a Chinese oh. restaurant. Oh my! No! No! Get it out! Get it out, you dick! <laughs> oh no! Oh god! You fucking animal! What is that? That appears to be some sort of uh, water snake going up a. Upper, no! Upper Willy. Yeah. Oh god, Peter, sorry. It's alright, it does. <laughs> just that. broken a flag. Just broken the Gambian flag. Oh, it's just broken the flag of Gambia. Yeah. No, I've not. Fine. It's alright, I'll stay. Okay. But like, Disgusting. sensibly, they have tied a little cable tie to the end so they can pull it back out. You know, that's good That's good thinking. Get it out! It's Get coming, it out! It's coming out. Get it out! Dun, dun, oh, it's going back dun, in. Dun, dun, it's going oh, back in. No. <laughs> Is it nearly gone? Ooh. Shouldn't have had them lemon Oreo oh, cookies. They're not lemon. They're not. They're like in butterscotch. No. Oh. <laughs> you okay? You're right. That's, that one's next. rough, isn't it? Hor is it? That is fucking horrifying. All right. Well, like, uh, we'll go next. Uh, what's your favourite way to cook eggs, Dan? Not, not like this. Not this way. Yeah. It's like imagine. mashing your bell end with some sort of snake. I mean, I don't eat eggs. I don't know if that's going to make it worse right. or better. Here we go. Just mix well, it some eggs. That's a good way to mix Just eggs. Just mix some eggs. Oh, wait. Wait, wait. Stop. Stop it. What the fuck is that? What do you think it is? That looks like a really... F that that looks like a premature baby's hand. Do you, do you know what it is? <laughs> Whis whisking. <laughs> I'm here early. Might as well make breakfast. So, do, do you, have you worked out what's happening yet? It looks like a man using his dick to whisk. Yes, but, like, how is he holding the dick, uh, the whisk, with his He's dick? He's got a piercing through his dick it's and it's through his Oh, nose. my Lord. Yeah, it's fine. I want to well, see. I want to see the control where you don't have to hold the end of the whisk. Yeah, I know. Like, I wanted to do it no hands. Yeah. Show me something else. I really yeah. want to see. That's pretty. Yeah. 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 Ooh. Why would you? I, I mean... know. I know why it's freaked me out so much. The dick. The the, worm. the thing going yeah. into the yeah. dick. Because there was a film, and I can't remember what it was, 
it's a, like a 70s sci-fi film film nuts will know this yeah and there's an ear like an alien earwig that is put inside of a helmet yeah and they and it put it on the guy as torture yeah and the earwig oh, is yeah. in the helmet with it yeah. goes, goes in, in his ear, ear. Yeah, yeah and i watched it too young and it get it gave right. me nightmares oh. it was one of, probably one of those things if you if even at the time, if you're an adult, you'd be like, "Oh yeah, it's just like it's." Yeah, all, yeah, yeah, yeah. Weird. But as a you know, when you see shit as a kid, yeah, like yeah. I watched RoboCop on my ninth birthday, and at the start of RoboCop, when the bad guys just keep shooting him, yeah, yeah, yeah. It, I was too young for it, and it fucked me up. Yeah. That earwig in the ear has haunted me, uh, and the creature going in the dick just. Yeah. It, so I, insects are a bad thing for you. It, honestly, dick eggs all day. Uh, no. What are you watching, Dan? What's this video? It's it's a family, of, <laughs> a, a large family of maggots yeah. in a foreskin. Yeah. She just die. That guy deserves to die. Yeah. yeah. Die. End your life. Oh, there's one in the dick. Is that the one? Oh, look at the special one. Yeah. He is the chosen one. <laughs> he lives in the dick palace. We yeah. serve him. Yeah. He's, he's dressed as the queen. Well, no, what? I reckon I like to think that he's been democratically elected. <laughs> and that he's been a process of campaigning. No, no, Russia interfered with the elections. Oh, you mean he's a puppet leader? He is, yeah, yeah. It's been installed by Putin. <laughs> Putin it in his dick. <laughs> Just die. I want this guy to die. I yeah, want his I don't dick like to this guy. burn it. Yeah. Burn your dick. Yeah. I don't know if fire's gonna be strong enough to deal with this. <laughs> Just pick Look that big him. one out. Oh, it's f yeah, it's out. It's already out. No, but watch it. Oh, let me back, back in. Oh, let me back in. <laughs> oh, like a big kid on the big kid on the bus. I go where I want. You little shit. You disgusting fucking. Look oh, at his fingernails. Oh, look at his well. fingernails. That's, yeah. it's, 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 Why are you course. surprised he's got gross fingernails? Of to be course, fair. he's an animal. Yeah. Uh, let's just keep going. What's this one? Oh, here. Here's one here, which is quite hard to work out what's happening for a sec. Balls. Yeah. Oh, them nail down balls. Yeah. Ooh. Four big ones. I feel like that. Four big ones. I've... About 20 medium sized ones. <laughs> boom, boom, boom. Boom, 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 boom. All right. Let's dance. Anyone? Long time for romance. Boom, 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 boom. If there is boom, anyone, boom, 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 if there's anyone hey. watching this who like is a music producer, make us a beat so, out of this tune. Wait. Let's just have a little talk. Wait. I'll tell you, Martin. I can't remember the DJ's name. You've got me intoxicated. Yeah. I think he's already done it. So, so, Martin hang about. So, Solvig. So, oh, so, so this is, Close. I mean, it looks like a Chinese medicine for getting rid of herpes or something like that. Do you know what I mean? I don't know if that's helping. You're no. introducing more holes for it to get in. <laughs> I don't know if that's how herpes works. Look at acupuncture there. Look yeah. at, do you know It's a really strange reaction I've got to these videos. Yeah. A guy has nailed his testicles onto a 4x4. Four four yeah. four four. That four. was Preston coming out, yeah, wasn't it? Was, I don't know, a piece of wood. And I tried to make myself sound more like man like. Yeah, 4x4. Yeah, four four. What's that done? I don't know. A car. <laughs> <laughs> um, uh, but, uh, he's ne and and I don't find it offensive because everything's clean. His yeah. dick and his balls, although saying. there's so many nails in them, yeah. I'm like, well, at least you've had a shower before yeah. you did it. No, that's true. Yeah. Like you know, at least you know he's having some good clean fun. I'm more offended by the way you wank, sir. Yeah, it's weird. Just a couple of fingers. Although to be fair, I imagine you got to be quite careful. How you move it? Oh well, yeah, because you don't want to hurt yourself, you don't... Did you? Rob, yeah, good point. Oh yeah, you've got to be careful, otherwise you might scratch your scratch your finger. <laughs> oh, the amount of regret when he comes. That's it. That's what I always think with these. The post not clarity must be intense. Yeah. Because like I, I, you know, I've had I'll it. Where I just what. watch some like mucky porn. I'm like, oh no, I should, oh, that's gross. I'll tell you what. I bet his toolbox is a thing of glory. <laughs> I bet he's clean. got one hell of a toolbox. Yeah. Like all different fucking hammers in there. Just loads of pliers. Nails, screws, pliers. A few fucking lug nuts just in case. 
I reckon he's he's the most prep. Yeah. <laughs> what do you want for Christmas, Dad? Just get me another DIY set. <laughs> but we never see you do any. <laughs> You never fix anything round the house. Use that drill. Well, <laughs> well, oh, you not can't not, not that you know. You can't have kids. Oh, I'm, nah. I'm in here. I'm in here. <laughs> the door's not locked. It should be. Yeah. Everyone's got to be on holiday when you bust this out. So it's <laughs> Dad's garage. Stay out. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Right, we'll have one more little one, shall <laughs> we? Doing it in the garage. <laughs> like you have to go to the nails. Yeah. Uh, let the nails come to you. What's that? What do you think it, it might well, be? It, it looks like someone's uh, put a candle in a plum. Yeah, it does look a bit like that. Which is, uh, <laughs> And it seems to me <laughs> you lived your life like a candle <laughs> in a plum. <laughs> but was it really a testicle? Oh, no, it's not and a testicle. And did it make you come? No, what you're looking at is the tip of a peen. No, it's not the tip of... It's Happy not a candle. Happy <laughs> to you. Oh, don't say that because he's won. Look, <laughs> tell you what's time with this. You can watch it burn. Look, it goes black. What, the the willy? Look, it, look. It's got oh, damage. my gosh. That's a willy. That's like a birthday cake. Oh, no. There's also oh, some heck. cable ties down it. Again, they've attached something to it to pull it out, though, so that's good. Yeah. Ah, yeah, you fucking hell. How old are you now? <laughs> Imagine if it was one of those trick candles. It just wouldn't it, go out. It blew, it just popped back up again. God damn. <laughs> Have you had a fun time watching these videos, Dan? Hey. <laughs> yeah, it's quality. Poo, yeah. Poo's my thing. Poo's, poo's your thing. thing. I think I've always... Right, I think I'll, I'll show you it. one last one if Poo's your thing. two girls, one cup. Yeah. Have you not? Well, I've never been, you know, I can't monetize it. <laughs> if it's going out on Patreon, I'll yeah, fucking... that's fair. Uh, you should do some React videos on Patreon. We'll show you these to you and Adam. Don't get into our fucking territory. Oh, you, yeah. You stay out. You st oh, yeah, you just remember. Yeah. Yeah, you stay away, otherwise shit. we'll do a ghost hunt. <laughs> oh, God. You're welcome. Um, Barry, did you, did you... Barry doing a ghost hunt for every podcast in the North did West. You, did you genuinely see anything when you did those ghost hunts? You haven't watched the ghost hunts, have you? No, no, no. Because no. I'm, I'm not paying. Like, no, no offence. Right. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. You got, you got 13,000. I'm, I'm I nearly became one, one of the thousand because I was so chuffed for you and they went, no, oh, right, calm down, Dan. <laughs> Just fucking tweet about it. Yeah. yeah, there's a limit. Just share. Just in, share. in my head, I was like, "I'm paying you a pound no, a month." I, I've never. I, yeah, I, I saw a, Patreon twenty p. I, I saw a little clip of Adam when he was on the stairs and he was pulling a hissy fit. He was, "I am not going back in that house." Like, like, like yeah. proper. Yeah, yeah. He got himself really wound up the first time. But uh, doing two ghost hunts. Um, if you watch the first of those ghost hunts, there was a bit of me was getting a bit jibbed out. Yeah, and. Within an hour of being in there, you're like, oh, oh, nice. You just, you just watch, you just watch it unfurl. It's a horrible, uncomfortable yeah. house. But if you go there yeah. and you, the, if you're there already, it's because you're on a ghost hunt because exactly. you want to believe. Yeah. And you're there if your with five out, other fucking tense. lunatics who believe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I watch Barry, who is very much a believer, in, Freaks in there. Freaks himself out. Yeah. Convince, they convince themselves. I just had to watch Barry in the most haunted house in the UK for an hour and a half to be like, cool, I get it. Yeah, I just yeah, hadn't yeah. I just hadn't seen the mechanics of how it works. Yeah, and, yeah. and as soon as you've seen it, you go, at one point, the cameraman just went like that. And he yeah. went, Barry, oh, Jesus fucking Christ! Yeah, Did yeah. you hear it? Did you hear it? And I'd watch the guy pick up the tripod and bang. Yeah. Yeah. And, and I was like, it's the tripod. He's like, oh, right, 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 right. Yeah. If I'd not seen it, Irish and if there was, uh, uh, right. <laughs> Tommy Shore, there's a ghost in this house. Yeah, he does yeah, when he gets scared. He's like, to, fuck used, me, no. He used to live in Leverage. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. And now he's like, oh my god, a ghost. <laughs> um, uh, is that my uncle's Audi Q7? Um, <laughs> yeah, he just completely convinced himself. Now Barry, yeah. Barry's the, Barry's got it in him to be like that, and Adam's yeah. got a bit of that as well. Yeah, yeah. yeah. By the time we got to the castle. I was having a great time. The thing is, I'd seen it, I'd worked it out, yeah. I'd seen how popular it was with our patrons. Yeah. I was like, "This is cool. Yeah, I'm yeah. making a lot of money." Watching we got Adam there. Shit we got there. It was a long drive to North Northumberland. Yeah. Everyone was like, "Oh God, we're in the castle." I went for an afternoon nap when we got there on my own, and everyone was like, "On your own?" I was like, <laughs> the, "Earplugs in." It was fucking the, great. The, the thing is, is if I ever did something like that, 
it would be the worst content. Yeah, it wouldn't be because, good if me and Fred because did it. neither of us believe at all. But there's not even a belief thing. I know a hundred percent unequivocally yeah, that yeah. ghosts don't exist, and there's nothing that can be done to change my mind. A ghost course, could literally yeah. walk in, get its dick out, jizz in my fucking face, and I'd still be like, oh, oh, the wind. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Like, like I'm, I'd I'm never just not get that rid guy. Of it. The wind. Yeah. The wind just came on my face. Oh, the wind just came on my face. <laughs> Gay, rapey wind. Gale force winds. Yeah, cool. <laughs> right. I think at that point, as I was, I was rubbing ghost jizz out of my eye, I'm like, maybe I'm becoming a bit more of a believer. <laughs> yeah. No, I just... And I then just, I'm like, oh my God, that's my thing. I just can't... It, like, the thing is, is it's I like know, you said... But that's why it's not good content, is it? Anytime Don't the, do a ghost hunt. Anytime nah. there's a bang, <laughs> oh, what was that? I'd be like, it was a bang, it's an old house. Yeah. My house bangs all Probably the fucking, fucking time. Probably your fucking knees. <laughs> well, they've blown out. Yeah. Yeah, it's not. Right. It's but it, it's it's made way more fun if you've got Barry and then someone who's. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But by the time we got to the castle, Adam, yeah. Adam was done with it. Was he? Yeah, he. But we all drove away going, "Yeah, it's fine." Yeah. By the when we were in the house, the first one, Adam was shit scared. I got himself was... totally wound up. Mm-hmm. It's the theatre of it. It's the theatrics. Yeah. It's it's the the surroundings that. And makes you know, it a lot of Adam's family are ghosts, so you know, I might be worried he's running into him. The Adam's family. Boom. <laughs> Just his mum. Just his mum. Uh, <laughs> shall we show you one more little one before we go? Oh, tish. Just a little quick one. Seeing as poo's your thing. Tell your ass is exploded. My ass has exploded. <laughs> It has, to be fair. Just wait another, <laughs> wait another minute and a half for round two. <laughs> yeah, I'll just check Twitter. Bet that guy's got killer pins and needles. Do you know what? Oh, the sound of that is so offensive. You have to turn that down on the edit because that was unbearably loud. Absolutely no way uh, to do that. Can, so, I, yeah, can I just... Can I, it's less disgusting because that man is so unhealthy. He's managed to turn his shit... Clearly coming out of his fucking horrible ass onto mm. whatever or whoever that is, but it's less offensive because it does look like salted caramel ice cream. Yeah, that's what my <laughs> toilet sees about four times a day. Is that what your shits are like? That consistency, yeah. <laughs> and you do that voice, <laughs> mate. Ma- I'm essentially gonna have to do a <laughs> Bristol stool chart with videos we've got. Is it like this? Is it like this? Is it like that? Your poo? I think. I th- I- <laughs> is that like, what your poo's it's like? It's like a shit Rorschach test, isn't it? <laughs> Is that what it's like? No, 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 no. Right, Sometimes okay. it's 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 got a watery consistency, but it's never as um, custody as that. Sure. I tell you what, Chekhov was right, wasn't he? Yeah. You set it up early. Exactly. You've got to have the payoff. Exactly. Oh, it's what we do, mate. Structure. Now, have mm. you got anything that you 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 do you do a, you, do a, a you do a podcast? You do a podcast. Oh, yeah. Oh, we've wound that up now. Now oh, they've yeah. seen you guys. <laughs> Hashtag of the future. Now that we've destroyed your coattails, riding Fucking on them. Fucking brilliant. I know. Yeah! yeah. To the to December the 9th. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> this has been absolutely everything I wanted it to be. I'm more. so glad, mate. Thanks for uh thanks for coming. It's been a pleasure having you. You know, and thanks for sorry. loaning us some of your fan base. Sorry for the shop sh- sorry for the shop talk, everyone. But uh, uh I think we I think, I think we've, we've more than covered it. The, oh, we got tre- some, we got tremendous. Some lo- we got some lovely little videos of Dabby and Sick into a bucket. Yeah. Yeah, lovely little videos. Yeah. That was actually for the theatre of it. Yeah, uh-huh. sure. Wanna come for a kebab? <laughs> Only if it comes out of Freddy. <laughs> <laughs> right, uh, if, if you haven't already, by the way, uh, the way to see all these videos is to sign up to the Patreon, patreon.com forward slash Talk pod uh it's three quid a month forever and for that you get access to our discord with all the weird videos on them you get access to <laughs> early uh, it's not episodes your, it's not your camera you get an uh, you get an extra episode of uh Pigoted podcast a week at uh, Pigoted fucking dead men talk pod ah, a week. No i said one, it wrong no one wants more Pigoted. we Fuck got off. we got live shows uh june the, this is disintegrated live shows <laughs> june the 15th like and subscribe. Send us, send us a video to 0752064931. Thank you ever so much for watching. Our guest has been Dan Nightingale. Fuck off. Oh, fuck, cunt. Damn.